All right, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, and welcome to today's stream. Welcome. Today we're gonna uh, maybe clear this game. I don't even know because at least I think Groudon is gonna be the final fight, but who knows, right? And they also say, you know, uh, the adventure is almost over. So I think today we're gonna clear the game. I don't know. Let's go, Mac McCavern. For some reason, these are higher level. Nice. Oh, wrong button. Uh, no, I don't want to go to. Oh shit. Oh, thank you! Aha! Thank God that the party member was too big. Yes! <laughs> ah, come on! So you're only allowed to enter it with two, huh? Or maybe if I get rid of one, I'm doing. There you go, visit. And then. Stand by. Oh. So what if I do it with Epsil? Because at least in the manga uh, that I read of this, I was allowed to have Epsil with me. There you go. All right. So you're allowed to have three. So this is it. The underground cavern where Groudon is. Look at all the flowing streams of lava. Wouldn't surprise me if the dungeon is scorching hot. Other rescue teams should already be inside. Yeah, because it took me a couple days to get ready. Let's get in there and give it our best. They probably are all dead. Ah, well, let's go. I've never been in this dungeon before. I do not remember this. It seems that I do get. I did actually get quite close to the end. Noise. We already begin, eh? Oh, my boy, Totodile. My boy, Totodile. We literally already begin. It's unbelievable. Ah, well. Not even going to. <laughs> Not even going to bother. Well, right now, the enemies don't really look that strong. Maybe literally, uh, you don't even have to grind in this game. And maybe if you do, that just ruins the entire difficulty of the game. Because lately, I'm not really having any problem with the difficulty. Well, yeah, of course, getting murdered by Totodal, but that's about it. Not really any really... Uh, not really any really big troubles. It would be nice if I could recruit those. Nice. Because I still got quite a lot of apples with me, so... At least I think so, right? Yeah, I got multiple huge apples. So I'm good, and I just picked up a normal apple as well. Because I think, of course, this is going to be one of the longer dungeons. Because obviously, it is the final dungeon, I think. So. There you go, to the dead end. Yes. So, and then afterwards, we're going to play some Stardew Valley. I think I will probably start a new uh, game, just to see what changed. So, bonk. And plus, you know, so we don't have to sit through winter with uh, having already everything. Because my other save file, of course, is pretty much done. So... So that's why. I mean, you know, we can try some other stuff, try some new, see what's different. I don't really need to get anything else in that game because I pretty much already got a lot of it. There you go. 
Wait, what? I used Ember, though. That's not even a melee attack. So, uh, huh? <laughs> How's that magic work? There you go, I don't even have more than 80 health. Alright. Move cannot be used anymore. Now we'll do this. There you go. Dig. Alright. Look, we just got dig. Great. Don't really need it, though. Alright, we're poison again. Great. In those situations, it's best to actually hold on to just a, a, a patch of scarf. Alright, absolutely is level up. So there you go. So these situations, sadly, we do have to go on. Because I do not think I have anything against the poison. If I'm right. Yeah, I don't have anything against the poison. So there you go. Look, lava. Something I can step on, but you guys can't. <laughs> nice. Time to get poisoned again. Oh, no, never mind. Alright, great. Didn't get poisoned. Hey, oh, you never know. It's always useful. At least uh, the spikes are way more useful than the rocks. Because they also do a lot more damage. And go way further. There you go. That's what I mean. I don't even have more than 80 health. That one didn't even have more than uh, probably 75 or something. Because I literally did 78 or 79 damage and he was killed in one hit. So, you know. Let me take this one. I'll handle him. <laughs> There you go. Problem solved. Getting hungry. Well, I will wait then. Till I'm completely hungry. Hey, our best to thank you so much with the raid. Awesome, awesome. Welcome to the stream, everybody. Welcome. And good morning, of course. Good morning. Oh, we had a fun stream. Get out of here! Oh, I can already not use that move anymore. Well, yeah, nice. Didn't get poisoned at least. Warp scarf. Never seen that one before. But yeah, how are you all doing? Start early morning stream. <laughs> well, for me, uh, it's just a couple minutes past eleven uh, in the morning. So, eh. <laughs> ah, well. It is awkward. Well, guys, later. Because <laughs> I cannot move backwards. And there are the stairs. There you go. The only uh, Pokemon I'm worried about is Absol. Because Absol's only level 23. Now I'm level 31, and he's Totodile's level 30. So. Ah, oh, there's Absol. Great. Alright. Come at me! Alright, well, one. One can still come at me. There you go. Naha! Still don't know why that happens. Literally started happening after I went into the dojo. The Totodile just started attacking me as well. I have, I have a slight feeling that the AI is a little bit broken. But ah well. Ah well, as long as he doesn't kill me. <laughs> he has already done that twice, but you know. That was in an area that was not that important. This one is quite a... Hey! You do that too. Come on now. Somebody's... Did you just throw... He just killed his own ally. What are you doing? He's just throwing those spikes everywhere. It's not good, man. <laughs> well... Later, everyone. Nah, Totodal seems to get it. Nasty. Hey, at least you killed him. Alright. Next. 
So I think we'll have... Uh, oh, oh, there you go. Color is already changing of the dungeon, or at least the uh, scenery. So we're getting somewhere. So I think we'll have one midway uh, checkpoint. Maybe at 15. Because I expect that this will be the longest dungeon in the game. If it's the last one, you know. At least that would be logical. Might even be multiple checkpoints, actually. Because right now it's not really that difficult, this dungeon. So I uh, am kind of interested how strong Groudon will actually be. Because, of course, I will not be the one that will do the most damage. Because I'm a fire type. Groudon is a ground fire type as well. So that's not really going to work. But then again, I don't think he will do much to me either. At least I hope. Because he does have ground attacks. So, you know. We'll see. We'll see. And then again, I have multiple... Uh... Oh, oh, Alright, there you go. I have multiple Orin Berries. So... I can manage. And I have a slight feeling we're not really that out of level. Because... It doesn't really... Uh... You know, get me anywhere near trouble, health-wise, with the the Pokémon's here. And how many elixirs do I have? I have one, two, three, three elixirs. All right, that that should be more than enough. Very nice. Do want to know how all the, the other rescue teams are actually doing it? Because of course they are evolved Pokemon after all, so you know they are probably stronger than us. Silver gummy. Uh, let me see. Let me use a max elixir, so I can do this. Hi! There you go. But it didn't change. Doesn't seem to dislike this gummy. Alright. So, silver one is not really his favorite. Fair enough. New. New, 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 new. Oof. But then again, see, this is what I mean. This was a ground attack. Super effective, and all it did was two damage. So that's why exactly what I mean. That's why I think, hmm, I don't think Groudon will do that much to me. Because, uh, huh, huh. <laughs> Super effective, ground attack, two damage, and that's all. I don't know. Darn it. Hey, that explosion didn't even kill him. It's supposed to actually kill him. What? What's this? <laughs> Alright then. Ah, oh, just a nice circle. Cool. Bonk. And he's my fuck. Even my fire attacks uh, do a lot of damage on the fire Pokemon. So, you know. Well, I do think that Groudon will probably be a Pokemon that will absorb the fire attacks. You know, and just boost its stats with it. Because we had a couple like that already. Hey, level 32. Nice. Leveled up. The flame on my tail grew bigger too. Yeah, boy. Hey, absolutely leveled up as well. Nice. And I probably will not be able to recruit any of these. Hey! Hey, go throw it out on me. Get out of here. Because I can take it. 
Because if I would be able to recruit one of them, then I could actually kind of, you know, map out the level that this dungeon is. Or at least the level that you're supposed to be at, at this uh, dungeon. Because it doesn't really seem too difficult. Literally, a fire attack on a fire Pokemon right there did 111 damage. I don't know if that's right. <laughs> hmm... Betcha Scarf? Alright, well, a little too late with the Betcha Scarf. Guys, I don't think... Well, yeah, we have Arbok, though, but... Then again, I don't think Arbok actually poisons you if you hit it with melee attacks. Could you stop that? So... But who knows? Who knows? Alright, we're at floor 12 already. Nice. Hi! So I think this might just be the last dungeon and then beat Groudon, get some story, and then I think that's it with the game. I don't think there's really that much more. But then again, I've not played as a child, I've not played through this part. Because I do not know this. So... Uh, let's see. I don't really need... Where's the teleport scarf? Alright, teleport scarf's gone. Interesting. Probably already threw it away. There you go, because I like that one a lot. So, don't mind if I do! Quick dodger. I like that one. Hold up. There you go. Eh. And of course, uh, for of course the people that don't know, obviously the stairs are there. You know, the stairs I need to continue into dungeon. But I don't know. I just wanted to explore a little bit in the uh, area, because there you go, I already got the red gummy, and some other stuff. So, who knows, we might still be out here. Because I know I probably will not be able to recruit any of these Pokemon, because obviously, you know, it's the last dungeon. So, you know... It would be a little weird if I build up a crew, literally, in the final fight. What's this? Racket band. What's a racket band? Hold item helps awaken hostile sleeping Pokemon. It only works against Pokemon that were asleep from the start. Alright. I suppose. Absol, let me deal with this. There you go. You're a little too weak for that one, Absol. I'm sorry. This is what I mean. They don't really... I don't really get poisoned if you touch the R-Box. Hmm. What's this? Warp Scarf. And this Taunt. Nah. And here we have... A Link Box. Also not really that important. Because I, I don't think I really need the Link Attacks. So... But then again, it will be the final fight, so... Nice one, Absol. You're standing in my way. Could you move out for a second? Thank you. Alright. Floor 14. So we'll see. Will 15 be the shortcut? Or uh, the checkpoint? We'll have to see. Because I think we already had a dungeon with uh, the checkpoint being at level 15. So. 
But then again, that's, those are our new Pokemons that we are finding now. Eh. Hey. Come on now. Yeah. Oh, nice. I'm already out of most of the moves. Why did I take up moves that uh, have a really low uh, PP? Shouldn't have done that. Get out of here, Rider On. Fetch a scarf? Nah. Well, I'm just gonna take a rest in a couple seconds. There you go. What? Oh, I'm still sleeping. Don't mind me. Hey, thanks! You broke me up there, pal. Appreciate it. Yep, this is going to be one of the longer ones. Because the shortcut is not at... Uh, 16, maybe? Hey, well, hello there. It's a Grimer. It's a... Hmm. The checkpoint is not at 16 either. So it is going to be one that will take a little while. Hey, I can do that too. Minus more damage either. Get out of here. There you go. That's better. Well, I suppose let's continue then. Until we get to the checkpoint. You really like to try to poison me, huh? Didn't even know they actually could learn a uh, poison attack. Huh, the more you know. Sand Slash can learn a poison attack. Kill. Stomp. Absol has been holding his own for quite, uh, quite some time now. It's actually pretty impressive for only being level 25 now. Pretty good. But then again, he has the most health out of all of us. He has 93. Totodile only has 90, and I have 91. So... There you go, Totodile leveled up. Totodile's HP did not go up. How strange. Totodile did level up, but his HP didn't go up. Hmm. Well then. Hey! I like that one. Uh, Whee! I don't need this. There you go. Just gonna walk past this for a second. Oof. There you go. That's the damage I expect. For an attack that's super effective. Type Advantage Master. Alright. Ah. I gotta choose. Quick Dodger or Type Advantage Master. Nah, it's Quick Dodger. More dodging ability. So probably 20 then. Oh, no, it's even different again. Or we maybe don't have uh, a checkpoint. Could also be something that you just straight up don't even get a checkpoint. You know, you just have to make it through uh, the entire dungeon and then to the boss. Could also be something. We do have to hurry up though, because sadly I do not have anything against uh, poison. So we have to find the stairs and get out of here before it's too late. Because I want to keep the orange berries for Groudon. Ah, it was too good to be true, eh? Alright then, come at me, folk. Show me what you got. I said, show me what you got, then actually show me something. Come on now. <sighs> Is that all? Let me just set flamethrower, because that will do a lot more damage. There you go. 
Come on, guys. Even Totodile does more damage. And he's my partner. There you go. So we move in a little more. So Totodile can actually attack the sides instead of only me. And may, most of the time, these is uh, these are supposed to be the traps, you know? Something that should be very dangerous. And most of the time, if you're not well uh, prepared with ore and berries and other stuff, it will kill you. But... Nah. That was it. We're all poisoned, though, so that's interesting. Come on, guys, let's move it. We gotta find that, uh, we gotta find the stairs or else we're in big trouble. So, hoppoy! Well, hello there, sir. Could you show, alright. Could you show us uh, the way to uh, the stairs? We great. I hope I'm going the right way. Because I do not want to really want to use orange berries, so. Yeah! Got him! We good. Or maybe the checkpoint will be at 20, and then we have to go another 20 afterwards. That would also be kind of cool. Because the thing is, as a kid, I hated long dungeons. Mainly because I just wanted to, you know, get to the boss, you know, and uh, get the story. But I, I don't really mind now. Well, Total just got healed and he's already poisoned again. Great. Oh, he was trying to attack. I see. I was just like, huh? Why did Absol stay behind? Interesting. No, we, we're just gonna continue. Alright, nice. Get out of my way. There you go. It's also super effective. I take it. <laughs> Ah, uh, Metal Claw. Probably an attack that I probably then have to use against Groudon. Interesting. Oh! Absol's gonna do it! Never mind. <laughs> there you go, that's how you do it. Hey, I'll take that. bother with him. There you go. If we can let Pokemon sleep, let them sleep. Well, hello there, Onyx! Dragon Breath? Could Onyx learn Dragon Breath? Hold up. Alright. I did not know that. Not the more you know. But then again, I'd never really used an Onyx, so, you know. it's probably the reason why I didn't know. Most of the Rock-type Pokémon, I don't know that much about. Other than that, they die really quickly. So that's why the developers in the later games gave them Sturdy. The Sturdy ability. So they at least will, you know, survive every one-shot attack. <laughs> at least he has more than uh, 80 health. Because I did more than 80 damage and he did not go down. Probably 90 or something. At least that's what I expect. Mm. 
Hold up, can I actually walk over this? Nah! -ha! Yes! You guys can take it. Come on now. It's just an onyx. There you go. That's all there is. Oh, two onyxes, eh? Nice. You guys were being trapped. Ah, well, you can handle it. Come on now. There you go. Oh! Hey! So level 24 or 25, apparently, is the checkpoint. Dead, and it's gonna be a big dungeon. Damn. Cool. Let's go. Keep going. Well, yeah. Mama Cavern Pit. The scenery didn't really change. The music changed a little bit, but that was about it. Come on, guys. Running out of budget here. <laughs> Whee! I don't even know why I'm picking up this money. I literally have more than 20,000 in the bank. I don't even need to pick up this money. A floating Steelix. Nice. So I suppose what I will do now is I will just go, you know... Uh, if I find the stairs, I'll just go. A weird jiggle. Ooh, 39 damage. And yes, that guy's more than 100 health. Because I did uh, more than 100 damage. Alright. We're getting somewhere, finally. We're getting to the real challenge now. Took him long enough, but you know. But I don't think this one might... Oh! Never mind. Let's see. I wonder where we are. I know we've gone pretty far. But, quick! So, literally, floor two? What? Ew, sailed down. Hey, Blue, over there! Well, hello there, guys. Hey, snap out of it! Uh, what happened here? We challenged Groudon and wiped out. Groudon? We crushed us. Wait, what about, uh, about Alexam? Where did Alexam go? Alexam is still battling Groudon. Blue, we've got to hurry. Damn, he's been battling Groudon for days now. But then again, he's a psychic type, so, you know, he doesn't really use physical strength. So his energy runs out way slower. Be careful. Well, duh. Ah. Oh, Alexam, are you okay? So it's you. Stay back. This opponent is no laughing matter. But duh! There's a freaking crowd on! Here it comes. Coming? But where? Under you! Alakazam? Well, Alakazam's gone. Was he maybe knocked out? Darn it. It's our turn next. Let's do this. I'm ready. But I'm not going down without a fight. There you go. I'm ready. Let's do this. Tiny Pokemon are going to fight a giant legendary Pokemon. Let's go. Blue. Hang time. Yeah. Let's do this. Eh. <laughs> Until he's in range, I'll just do this. Eh. <laughs> hey, it still does 42 damage. I'll, I'll take it. Eh. Nah. <laughs> Alright, so that's not super effective, it seems. Come on, Absol, you have quick attack. There you go. Oh, no, only just nine. Well then. I'm kind of, kind of scared to actually try a fire attack, because I probably have a feeling that it will probably heal from it. So, you know. Well, we uh, gladly tried to miss each other, it seems. Really, that was it? Really, that's it.
Look, it's Alex Sam. Charge on the range chart too. You guys suck. It was easy. I didn't even need to heal once. Come on. That cannot be it. Did you do it, Groudon? Are you alright? Yes, fine. We will be fine, but we must get out immediately. What about Groudon? Will it be okay? Your concern is unneeded. It will awaken soon enough. They have lost control only because it was enraged from ha having its sleep disturbed. It should calm down. What? Another quake? Out quickly. Really? That was it? Having calmed ground on, Blue's team left the dungeon and returned to Pokemon Square together with Alexam's team. That was easy. Alright. But is that gonna be it though? Is that gonna be the final or? It was a little too easy to actually feel like a final battle, but. And in the square. Spruce team uh, almost there. Look, here they come. It's true, darlings. Let's go. Sup, bro? She boy's here. We didn't evolve once, but we took him out easily. That's right, silver team beat the gold team. What up? That's us. Hmm. Great work, great work, Blue. You really took down that Groudon. Darlings, it's fast and fantastic. You have won uh, me over. Well, wait a second. How does everyone know about what happened on the ground? Pelipper spread the word with an extra edition of the Pokemon news. Your bunch became stronger than I expected. He was easy. Come on, guys, really? You guys could not take that down? I didn't even need Absol with me. And I also did not need any Oring Berries. Come on, guys. If that's... If literally you cannot beat that, then... Oh. Should re I should reconsider. <laughs> you can be proud of it. Why? You loved it. Great. Why don't we team up sometime? Oh, yeah. You want to steal my power, huh? You've earned everyone's respect now. The team must... Must... Is a first class rescue team. Take pride in that. Totodile, blue. Blue, it's great. All the work we put in, it was all worth it. Will you look at that? I don't think someone that could take down Groudon's be such a crybaby. Ah. Uh. Huh? What was that? Thought I heard something just for a moment. Did I just imagine it? No. I heard it too. Me too. Even now I hear it. Someone's talking. Not sure. This voice. I remember this voice. This voice, I think, is Satu. Satu? Ah, that's it. Telepathy. Satu's talking out to us using telepathy. It's all Pokemon calling all Pokemon. Terrible it is. From the sky. False star. From the sky comes a star. It is huge. A giant of a star. The star it falls. It falls straight to us. Disaster in nature. There were many. The balance of the world it has been upset. All because of the star. Star that slowly comes closer. Keeps coming, will crash into this world. Shall be terrible. Something must be done. Satu, tell us. Can the falling star be stopped? There is a way. To prevent collision, there is a, but one solution. You must ask Rayquaza. Rayquaza? What might that be? A Pokemon living far above us in the sky. Legendary it is. Requires I must be asked to destroy a star from the sky. However, far, far up in the sky lives Requaza, known uh, by few and seen by none. The sky. How are we to go there? Let's Sam and I amplify our teleport together and send Pokemon to the sky. However, the sky and the world above the clouds. What will become of the Pokemon sent to the sky? Even I can guess nothing. Then we'll do it. We'll go up. 
I also thought there sure could be none but you. But, are you sure? There's no telling what you would find in the world above the clouds. We expect danger. It's my wish that all Pokemon can live in peace. Tada! Blue, do you hear? It's Satu. Discuss we, uh, we will, ex Alex, Sam, and I about how our teleport can be amplified. Departure it is tomorrow. Rest you should until then. Last word. Dangerous will be your adventure. But fail you must not. Surpass yourself. It's probably not even going to be that difficult. No problem. We'll be fine. Hey, Blue, let's get it done. It's probably not going to be that difficult. Literally. Well, I have a feeling that this is the final, then. Yep, I'm all ready. Great. Looks like we're all set to roll. Let's go. Ah. Gonna take a rest. Oh, we're gonna have to dream again. Oh, I feel horrible. Oh, God. This is a dream, isn't it? But why? Why do I feel this terrible? This is the first time... Oh, I know. He's a dream eater, after all. How oh, do you like dream eater? Horrible, isn't it? <laughs> but who would be thought you were also human before? Didn't expect that. But who cares? Someone like that sure to be some low life. I'll expose you yet. I'll expose what in your heart with dream eater. Hmm? Something's coming. What was that light? He's coming closer. Yeah. His pain is going away. There you go. Gardevoir? Gardevoir, will you tell me now? Who are, uh, who or what am uh, I am? Yes, the time has arrived. Why you have come here? I will tell you all there is to tell. Blue, you have come to save this world. Well, of course, I'm the main character. That's kind of logical, but all right. Came to save the world of Pokemon? I did? Yes, we learned that uh, this world faced extinction, and so we uh, saw the hero. But uh, though we searched nowhere could we find a hero, we were becoming discouraged. When we came across a human, Blue, you were that human. What? Wait a second. Hero me? It's too, uh, too much. Not anything special like that. Yes, it's also what you said that first time we met. You said you were not strong. But what we sought was not power, merely for display. We sought true courage. True courage? That? I'm even less confident about that. That too is what you said when we met. It was then that you sa said this. To see if you were worthy to be a hero or not. You asked that we put you to the test. And only if you were found to be truly worthy. Then you were to be t uh, told the truth. To fulfill your role clear of heart and mind. You then chose to erase your memory as a human. And became a hu uh, Pokemon of your own will. Uh, own will to fight alongside your friends. That is how you came to, the, to be in this world. I... I did that? The courage has been proven. Without question, you bear the role of saving the world. And that role, it is soon coming to its end. Stopping the meteor from crashing into this world. That's my role? Yes. And when this, uh, that is accomplished, you can return to your human world. Oh. So I can go back to, uh, being, a, to being a human. Wait! But that means... Yes. It means parting ways with Totodile. Thanks! Then I uh, don't get backstabbed anymore with water gun and ice beam. Thank you. <laughs> Totodile, I have to leave? Totodile feels great uh, kindship with you, Blue. So, Blue, if you were to leave, your friend would be heartbroken. But there can be nothing done. Because they are encounters, there are also farewells. I too once had a friend beyond value. Truly, I cherished our friendship. But my friend has gone away. Feels me, uh, it fills me with sadness still, loser my friend. But, we will meet again. That is what I believe. But, what was that? 
Who was it? Someone appeared to have been looking into your dream. But it is fine now. Whoever it was ran off. All that remain in this dream is feeling of sadness. That Pokemon, I think, ran off crying. It will be morning soon. Why does she always say a word for her? Didn't think she was French, but alright. Next morning. It's time. We must depart. <laughs> morning. Gotta go now. Sleep. This is it. Let's roll blue. To the sky we go. Well, sky tower. Let's go. Ah, good of you to come. Ah. What? What's going on? What is Saturn doing? It is almost ready. The teleport uh, gem. Teleport gem? Really, a gem. It is made. Oh, it's tiny, but alright. This, this is the teleport gem. This will deliver you to the world of the sky. Now, Blue, accept. Blue's uh, teams received the teleport gem. That was made using the power of psychics. By me, Alexam, and... Oh! A ghost-type Pokemon. We, was, uh, we received help from it. Gone away, it seems. Who could it be? Well, we all know who it is. Ha <laughs> ha! Must be bashful, let it be. Now, I must ask you this one last time. This journey will be fraught with consider considerable danger. Will you still go? We bet we will. We need to see Rayquaza and ask uh, it to blow up that falling star, right? That's what going uh, to bring back peace. I'm not going to think twice about giving up my life. That's what I want to make uh, to make happen. Yes. And when that wish comes true, Garfor said, You can return to your human world. be my last adventure with Totodile. Blue, let's do this right. We're counting on you, Totodile. Blue. Just saying, maybe Totodile should also hold on to it, probably for the best, or else he doesn't, you know, teleport away. And I'm the only one, but then again, I can probably handle it on my own. Because I have a slight feeling this is not really going to be tough. Eh, where are we? What? Blue is cool! We're on clouds! Oh, whoa! Blue, look up there! Oh. It's a huge tower of clouds! It must be at the very top. That must be where Rayquaza is. Blue, let's give it our best. There are probably a lot of dragon types here, I think. At least that's the feeling that I have. That there are probably going to be a lot of dragon types here. Uh, let's see. Let's throw away you. Because I do not use you anyway. Anything else I can throw away? Iron thorns. Throw those away as well. But then again. There you go. Ah. Oh no, we also have the uh, Lunatone and Solrock with us. Fair enough, but then again, there you go. Not difficult. Hmm. So what I will do, I think I will just go, you know, go up the stairs if I see them. Just, you know, get some speed in here. Because I don't think there's really much else after this. Because I know this is going to be the final. Because I Groudon seemed a little too easy to be the final. So, there you go. But then again, these guys also don't really look that difficult. Because now we probably have to fight Rayquaza. Oh! Hey, Lunta wants to join the team! Alright! 24! So there you go. The, le the level of this area is literally 24. Or lower or higher, but... That's still way too low for me. Come on, Shuppet. Why you do that? my item. Ep, ep. Ow. 
Well, it's good that you picked it up, Lunatone, but, uh, hmm. There you go. That's better. Hmm. Huh. That's the good thing about ghost Pokemon. There you go. Now there's an R domain. Stop that, please. <laughs> You're only making it more difficult, and not only for me, but for everybody with that. And it would actually be cool if we could also actually get Soul Rock on my team. You know, Lunatone uh, and Soul Rock both uh, with me it would be nice. Hey, oh, nope, Shuppet wants to be on team. Alright, level 28. There we go. So we're there we're getting somewhere. I don't wanna give them names. We're getting somewhere with this. So there you go, that's probably why uh, all the other dungeons were that easy, because I was just over leveled. And still kinda over leveled, but it's getting there. Brick break, alright. So there you go, I already have a team of uh, four Pokemon on me now. Hey, we don't do that here. Come on now. No. <laughs> there it is. Clear gummy. All right. And what's this? Sky gummy. We need a. If it was a blue gummy, then I would have picked it up. Ah. Rain scope lens. Well, sorry for the rain, but I'm out of here. Damn, we're already on eight. All right. Of course, it's going to be longer uh, than the other dungeon now. You are killing our shepherd buddy. Oh, boy. That's what I mean. It's, it doesn't only attack me. It literally attacks everybody that's in front of him. It's a little weird. Oh, I can already not use this anymore. All right. And Shuppet is pretty much dead. Great job, Totodile. Well done. Yep. There you go, that was the Reviver Seed. Thanks, Totodile. <laughs> oh, yeah, go on to kill all the, uh, go on to kill the other ones, why don't you? Great. Totodile, you're something else, are you? My god. Ah, well. Moving on. So, that was the Reviver Seed wasted. Whee! I'm gonna just use this. There you go. Bonk! Stairs are not here. Uh oh. Well, we cannot attack that one. Well, shop it can, but uh, we can't. Uh, well, sorry, shop it. There you go. Because that's the thing, I cannot attack into a wall. <laughs> Only shop it can. Or at least ghost Pokemon. Well, there you go. Level 33. Hmm, so coughing also resides here, huh? Alright. Bonk. There you go. See, plain seed should be there. It is. There you go. Don't need it anymore. This plain seed literally does nothing. So better to just get rid of it. Oh no! Oh, luckily the stairs are right there. Awesome. Because hail is really annoying. Because of that. 
go! So if the checkpoint was 20 last time, then I'm kinda wanna know what the checkpoint is gonna be this time. Hey, there you go, Soul Rock. Let's see if we can actually get a Soul Rock on the, uh, the team as well. That would be kind of cool. Ah, darn it. Then you know, Lunatone and Soul Rock. Yeah, boy. Because uh, when we got the checkpoint at Groudon, afterwards it was just, you know, well, literally to floor two and that was it. And we're already done. Hey. Leave my Luna Zone alone. There you go. Very nice one, Luna Zone. It would also be awesome if we could actually get that Pokemon on the team. Three hundred and seventy damage. That ain't even fair. Oh my god. Wow. Uh oh. <laughs> I've created a monster. And I literally, I only leveled up from level 15 at the start of the game to level 20. And that's all the grinding I did in the entire game. And already, we're this broken. Literally five levels, that's all you need to grind. And then you're done. Damn. Well, then again, it is supposed to, of course, be a kid's game. So, obviously, it's gotta be a lot easier than the usual, you know, dungeon crawler games. But still, come on now. <laughs> it's a little too easy. All you need to do is literally just grind uh, five levels and then you're set for the rest of the game. Of course, it also depends on what kind of Pokemon you have. There you go, don't want to waste the uh, big apple. Because who knows where the checkpoint is? The map is going to be kind of hard to see, though, with all this light. Hey! Would also be cool if we could get you in the team. No, oh, no, no Dusclops. All right. How about you? No, nope. all right. Well, we're flying through, though. Ah, oh, stay behind. There you go. Nice. There you go. That's a good choice. Because that was a dragon Pokemon. Come on, yeah. Well, already on 19. What's this? Light screen. Nah. Don't need light screen. There you go, 20. Alright, not the shortcut. Or, uh, checkpoint. So, we're gonna go further. 30. 25. I feeling that it's gonna be 30. Then again, we're flying through it though. Ooh, Flygon would be cool uh, to have on my team. Ah, darn it. Getting hungry again? Alright. I really desperately want to wait till we get... Oh, well, hello there. There you go, dust rubs down. Itchy ear. There you go. Noise. Hey, level 32. 
There you go, but I want to wait with my big apple until I get to, you know, the checkpoint. Because, mm, that is the last apple I think I have. So I probably should have brought some more apples with me. But then again, I also have gummies. So, and gummies will also actually quell hunger. Not even. Moving on. <laughs> Uh, there you go. Hey, Tropius! Tropius would be kind of handy because then we have fire, uh, water, and grass. And psychic. Uh, Alright, 30. Damn! It still gives some. Uh, there's still quite a lot of for belly, the gummies. Didn't expect that. Oh, I shouldn't waste it. Alright, 24. Let's see, 25. Because if we have 25 and we don't get the shortcut, then it's probably 30. Yeah, I think 30 until we get to the checkpoint. Whee! Never mind, it's uneven. Alright. So, 26. I don't mind that, though. And now we'll see how long uh, the second part of it is. But we gotta keep going. Sky Tower Summit. Power band. But uh, Lunatown already has scope lens. I'll keep the... Ooh, that a Metacross. Metacross on the team. That would be awesome. They are all super effective. <laughs> What's this? Thief. Hmm. And that's why I waited with my big apple, because now my belly is 100% again. So... That's exactly the reason why I waited. Well, I'm not recruiting anybody else anymore. It seems. Nobody else is really impressed with my power. Other than Lunatone. And the Shuppet, that Totodile so uh, wanted the dead, for some reason. And I wish that I could save it at the uh, other part. Ooh, Salamence. Ah, come on. Salamence is really good. That's one of my favorite Dragon-type Pokemon. Salamence is awesome. But I suppose it's not awesome enough to be in this team. Hmm. But then I go, then again, Metacross is my second favorite uh, psychic type, so you know. We have a lot of favorites here in this uh, area. Hi! Salamence, get over here. Salamence. Face me, Salamence. There you go. Thief. Darn it. Cloudy. Well, yeah, we're literally in the Tower of Clouds. So, a little weird why it isn't always cloudy. If you really think about it. Alright, you do survive Ember. Fair enough. There you go. Uh oh. Ah! Darn it! Total, you take uh, care of it, please. There you go. I almost killed my Lunatone. Poor Lunatone. He's just getting beaten up by his own crew. Literally, oh look! There you go, first exploration team that ever made it up here. Finally, I can make my Funim come to- Ow! Ouch, ow! Just getting hit by all, uh, by the crew. Yeah, boy! That's how it is to be an exploration team. Getting beaten up by your own crew. Ooh. Confusion, hypnosis, harden- Yeah, get rid of harden. Psywave. 
sounds really cool. Now the other attacks actually that you had were also pretty good. Then I think Rayquaza will probably be around level 30. I have a feeling. Because of the Pokemons, literally the strongest Pokemon I found was... Or at least that I uh, made part of my team was level 28. So... Salamence, be on my team! I know you wanted Salamence. Don't you go hiding it now. You'll want to be part of the team. Darn it. Another Salamence! Alright, the second try. Let's actually use Metal Claw now. That does a lot more damage. Would be awesome to have a team of four members, you know. And then going into the final battle with that. To see who will survive. Because I still have the entire load of the uh, Orange Berries. So, you know, healing with healing, we're still fine. <laughs> that guy's just getting wrecked. Sorry. Oh, got another one. <laughs> Sorry. Moving on. Oh, he has more than 130 uh, 13 health. Nice. Uh, you want to be on my team? Come on now. You want to. I know you want to. You want to. Darn it. He doesn't want to either. How about you? I gladly take anyone on. Literally, I will just take anybody uh, in my, uh, my team. Claydol will also be kind of cool to have. Thanks for almost killing me. Alright, well. Thanks, Totodile. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. You're my pal, after all. Look at all the Flygles! My god! Flygon and Tropius under there. Tropius, you wanna be part of my team? Come on, guys. Oh! Well, here we are. Is this the top floor? Who goes there? Who dares to trespass upon my airspace? That voice! Is that Rayquaza? Indeed I am. Disguise my domain. Depart at once. But we don't have the, the time to argue. We came here because you need, uh, we need your help. Never. Alright, thanks. You don't, we don't even know each other. Come on now. I am be, uh, the being of the sky and you are but uh, denizens of the ground. To each there is a world distant as their own. For hundreds of millions of years, never once have I descended to the ground. And the opposite shall also hold true. Well, too late. I'm here. <laughs> Let there be no mercy for those that defy the laws of nature. Prepare for the end. Alright. Oh, I had multiple huge apples. Oh, and also the big apple. Alright, well, Apple-wise, we should, would have been good then. Alright. There you go. Perfect. Do you? We still do more damage than that he does. I think he's around level 30. Nice. Hi. I missed, though. There you go, we don't do that much damage. Oh, he, actually, he can actually be affected by sleep. Nice! Great that we got Lunatone on the party. Woo! That's super effective. I like that. 
Huh? It does have a lot of health, but then again, of course, that's a kind of logical. He's a lot better than Groudon already. But then again, he will fall before me. Well, also did not heal once. Well then. Yep, you only need to have five extra levels going in. Well, early in the game, you need five extra levels. Because then, you know, the rest will be easy. What? what a quake? It can't be. We're up on the clouds. These are shock waves. And they are huge. That's it. I get it now. Look straight up, Rayquaza. Yep, there it is. What's that? Well, you know. It's a shooting star. An interject gigantic. It's going to destroy the world if it's uh, isn't stopped. That's why we came, Rayquaza. We need you to destroy that falling star. So that's why. Yes, hurry. Destroy it. <laughs> Before I try, I need to know your resolve. The star has come too close. If I were to lose my hyper beam here, you would not escape unscattered. So what? We knew that right from the start. Well said. Take charge of your destiny. Well, that doesn't really look that big. And plus, if you would destroy it, the rest of the rocks would, you know, still fall to the ground. Just saying. The other pieces of uh, the rocks. Uh. Well, Luna Town. Welcome to the team, pal. <laughs> Welcome to the team. I'm gonna go home and uh, Totodile almost died. Isn't it great? Is this a dream? No. This is no dream. Yes. The star's explosion swallowed, uh, swallowed me. And I'm now uh, adrift. As a spirit. It's going to happen. But this shadow. Gengar? Heh <laughs> Blue. Didn't take much to put you down. Serves you right. Heh <laughs> Now what do, to do with you? I know. I'll drag you into the dark world. That'll do it. Gengar's dragging me. Gengar said he would drag me into the dark world. What's a dark world? Am I going to be abandoned in the world I don't know? Huh? Darn it. I took the wrong path. What? This isn't like me. I can't tell which way it is which. Nah. Yeah. To heck with this. I'll just ditch you here. That's it. Goodbye to you. Hey. Hey, can you hear? Snap out of it. Huh? This place. <laughs> Dead. Regain consciousness. Sure of it. Sure. Back there. Gengar saved me. Maybe. Did Gengar save Blue too? Awesome. You're alive. You really had all of us worried. You were incredible. I'm so glad you're safe. That's fantastic. Yep, this is the final. I have seen this uh, the end uh, on it on YouTube. So, yep. Final, boys. Everyone, thank you. But. What about the star? What happened to it? Alright. <laughs> Fear not, the stars no more. Though it will not be right away. The disaster shall soon be calmed. What about our team member? Where's Lunatone? Be calm, Lunatone's safe. Oh, they actually put dialogue for it in there. Nice. That's the very first time that they actually put dialogue in there for your other team members. That is pretty cool. Nice. Really? We did it, Blue. We got, got it done. We've won peace. That is actually pretty cool. I like that. So Lunatone is safe. Nice. Yippee. 
This is the greatest. This calls for celebration. Let me shoot my hydro pump to kick it off. Whoa, hold on there. Don't you point those things at me. Face the other way. The other way. No, no. Let it loose. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I'll secure uh, him so he can't get away. Oh, not bad. What? Were you serious? No, don't. Nice. Blue. Ah. There you are. I was waiting. Come on now. Got a four. We owe everything to you, Blue, and your friends. Peace has returned to our world. Thanks you for everything. And now, Blue, your role here has ended. Soon you must return to your own world. This time to pay a bit farewell. It's finally come. This time has finally arrived. There you go, I'm already disappearing. Blue, I'm sorry for this. To everyone, please bid farewell. Well, I'm just standing there. Oh, Blue. But Blue, your body. What's happening? Totodile. And everyone, I'm sorry, but I have to leave. What? What are you saying? Everyone, thank you for everything all this time. Eh? Leave? What do you mean, leave? My role as a Pokemon has ended. I have to return to the human world. Unbelievable. Go back? To the human world? Huh? But why? Why? I don't understand. Why do we have to leave? Didn't we... Aren't we friends? Yes. You will always be my friend, Totodile. I'll never forget you. Wait, Blue. I'm blessed to have met you. I... What am I going to do with you when you're gone? I'm so very sorry. This is goodbye. Later, dudes. I'm out of here. Whee! Later, bro. Of course, the thing is, I already know what's going to happen, obviously. But, you know, you know. <laughs> Why? I don't understand. Why? Why was it necessary to leave us? Blue saved my life. But I hadn't done anything to show my thanks. Left. Before I could even say thanks. You're right. Just uh, up and went like that. Why now? Why when the world's been saved? It's when things were going to get better. S nah. This was coming. A world that was saved by Blue. I look back now. When bound for the sky, Blue seemed as if it were reassigned, reassigned to accept what was to come. I think I know. And uh, I think I understand now. Blue became a Pokemon to save us. And when, when the star was destroyed... Blue knew that would be the time to leave. Why? Why didn't Blue tell me earlier? If this was coming, why didn't Blue tell me? Those words couldn't be spoken. As much as you are, uh, are heartbroken now, Blue must have felt the same pain of leaving. Try to understand, Totodile. Nah, Blue. Ah, oh, still there. Geez. How far am I going to go up? My god. Don't drop me, please. <laughs> what is it? I'm rare rising into the sky. Is this my spirit? I wonder where I'm going. Voices. I hear voices. Your friend is heartbroken. A true friend. A friend for life. You finally realize it now. If you wish, and wish very strongly... You already know what that means, right? Perhaps you will meet again. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I 
Literally the exact same thing happened in uh, the other game. In the other uh, Mr. Dungeon game. At some point you'll just return. You'll just come back. So... That's kind of the thing, though. Uh, that ruins, you know, the moment. Because you're like, alright, well, we'll never meet again, right? This is it. Nope. <laughs> you're right back at it. Alright, then. Great. So yeah, we're gonna wait to see if there's anything after the credits, because in the other Pokemon Mr. Dungeon game there was. So... So yeah. Then you actually saw the cutscene, you know, of you returning to the world. So, probably gonna be here too, so... Uh... There you go. I don't want to leave. I want to stay longer. Well, uh, yeah. I wouldn't want to leave a world of Pokemon either, but you know. With my in uh, infallible. Irreplaceable friend. Ah. Sup, dudes? I'm big! That's exactly what I mean. <laughs> so that kind of ruins the moment, right? Because I already knew this was gonna happen. Because it happens, I think, in pretty much every single uh, Mr. Dungeon game. You know, you have to despair. Uh, psych, and you're back. So, you know, kind of ruins the moment if you already knew it, but... The story of Blue and Totodile ends here. But Muscles isn't done yet. There are many rescues to be done. A new adventure begins. The legendary Pokémon are set to make their appearances. Don't go away. Well, sadly, I will, though. Because now it's time for Stardew Valley. Let's see what changed. It's been a little while since I last played it. Unknown Dungeon. Using wireless communication, you can go on an adventure to unknown worlds. Damn. Alright. Friend rescue. Use wireless to the dual slot function or power passwords. Friends may rescue each other. Nice. Check your career as an adventurer. Yep, I got a lot of logs. Reached the hill of the ancient. Took the road as a fugitive. Prevented the meteor's collision. The rescue team base was completed. Rescued Smur Smurgle. 70, uh, 47 moves were learned. 32 Pokemon joined the team. 507 floors were explored. Holy moly. 507 floors, my god. That would all be in one dungeon, you know? Throughout the entire game, just one dungeon, and that's 507 floors long. Jeez, but alright, that's it. So, it should close the game pretty soon. There you go. Close the game. Alright, go to editor. Let me start up this. Because now it's time for our good old start of the game. So, let's see. Get you out of here and you out of here. There you go. Very nice, very nice. Where are you? There you are. Boop. And I do not need a controller for this anymore, so hey. Because I actually kind of want to know what changed, because that's been a little while, and there are new updates out now, so, you know, what has changed? What is new to the world? Uh, let's see, where are you? That's the one I need. Properties, yes sir. Stardew Valley, yeah boy. There you go, changed, alright, now I need to, of course, edit it again, to fit the screen, there you go. Alright, we're all good and ready to go! Of course, the music is probably something that I do have to edit, because obviously, you know, the music in this game is way calmer than, you know, in the other one, but, you know, 